Hello guys, welcome to Tony's Lads, you can see I'm not crying at all or anything because I've actually got stuff to show you, you know, in real life before we get to that bit. Just looking for it. Oh no, we've got Mr. Toopy and it's in there. Yeah. No, that won't be it. Oh, never mind, I think I found it. Yeah, I found it. I'm just taking everything away. By the way, um, some little short notices. Sorry if this episode will feel slightly rushed. Got other things to do as well. And Joel might call me. Joel's Roblox and Trace Bot might call me in the middle of this. Because um, that's how we like do videos together. That's how you get to hear a sexy voice. So I've got four things, four two peas to show you. Well, three two peas, and this, this is a half penny from um, 1967. What the hell is it doing in an arcade coin pusher? I mean, if you're a coin collector, you can't complain. One thing is the collection. Now this is a pristine condition two p. From 1971. I genuinely think this can't have been released. This must be like an NIFC. You've also got a coin this year that I'm just keeping hold on to just in case that that's an IFC because I think the Royal Men said they won't be releasing any into circulation for 10 years. So I'm just keeping that just in case. And we've got an Isle of Man one. 2001. That. Ship 2P. That's it for this section. Now we move on to um, the Alice in Wonderland coin that's recently came out. Okay, so it's this Alice in Wonderland. And look who's there. Good old Cheshire Cat. Obviously, uh, he's a male. So we just pretend that Cheshire Cat is Cheshire Cat. But it's spelt the same and stuff. And she's just his cousin. Because I didn't realise at the time. Okay, um, so, um, first of all, we are gonna, we're gonna look at these ones. Nice designs, I'd give the first one an eight and the second one a six. So, um, yeah, there's that. Pretty decent designs, and um, then you've got them brilliant uncirculated. Your silver proofs, which look better in real life. Your silver proof painted, and your gold proof. Mostly in stock. So, um, yeah. See what happens when we go on this. As I was saying, um, yeah, there's the Through the Looking Glass and there's the Alice Adventures in Wonderland. Obverse, still the same, just by Jodie Clark. But the um, reverse design for the lot of them was for Fionn Willem, who we've seen before. Wonderland's most devious denizen, the Cheshire Cat, disappears and reappears. 
I will, sparring with Alice in smug jibes and crafty twists of the tongue. And the Queen of Hearts always has such a temper. Especially if someone eats a tart. There's that. Just do a pause and read for that. We've got tons of pictures for this. So yeah, there's that. You say anything's possible as we're about to follow a little girl named Alice down a rabbit hole. Hold on to your imagination, keep your coins safe in your pocket. Things are about to get off the top. Whatever. But let's come to the end of this. Curiouser and curiouser. The greatest weapon in the war against reality and imagination. Dallas has no problems using hers. And the war against reality is imagination. Curiosity causes her to chase after an imperial white rapper and noble as food and drinks from labels drink me. That make us shrink and grow and blah 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 blah. It also guides us through oceans of tears and out of a house out of cell grows. Wonder there's a sick peculiar so it would be a bomb view on. There's plenty of room for conversations on this journey and lots of questions to ask and blah 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 blah. I'm not interested in Alice in Wonderland to be completely honest, so I don't really care. That's all I can say. It doesn't really have any real facts. It's almost like this was made for children, which obviously it was. But it's like really boring and nothing really I'm interested in. It's almost like too childish for my audience because 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 this is because this gets more mature by finger the jig. But um, yeah, thank you very much for watching. I hope this was interesting. See you next week. Nearly forgot to do this. It's a spicy meatball. Ooh, it sets up lucky penny.